everyone. The NASCAR season is pretty much winding down. And many of you know, I did a little fun project with my old Toshiba laptop recently, where I tried upgrading the RAM. Now I thought for an early 2010s computer, I could try to stream Sling TV or try to stream, for an example, Paramount Plus without any hassle. Well, yours truly was flat out dead wrong. And on Paramount Plus, I got so much lag. So that got me thinking. And I saw this random video talking about iCarly having a spinoff on Paramount Plus. And I noticed, hmm, this is playing Paramount Plus on the Google Chrome browser? Maybe I could try to use the developer options to maybe fake the location to WBOC television in Delmarva. My Ocean City, Maryland affiliate. So I want to have a foolproof way to watch the remaining NASCAR races. All right, because we got Vegas coming up this weekend. We got Homestead, Miami the following week. Then we got Martinsville, and then the championship in Phoenix, right? So this TV, and hello Superstorm Sandy antenna, that's what I call this thing right here. This Radio Shack antenna's been here since Sandy, because I was freaking out I couldn't have TV during Sandy, guys. I still have the OTA tuner, in case direct TV goes down over there. Excuse the mess in the living room, but... This is the last you'll see it. So that got me thinking, hmm, Chromebook, showing iCarly on the Chrome browser. It's a Chromebook. What should I do here? So, here it is. Easter Chromebook CB514 8 gig RAM Intel processor. So, why did I think of an 8 gig? You may be wondering. Well, 8 gigs is pretty much what I have on my Dell gaming laptop on the Windows 11 machine I currently have now. So that got me thinking. All right, I looked really hard and this listing came up and I did my research on YouTube, right? I could scroll on the iPad, but it's only a dent. But when I do my review, I'm hoping to maybe have a review. Hmm. Let's see here. Let's go up the calendar. Let's pull up my calendar. Here we go. Okay. So I'm hoping to have the review maybe the same week or maybe the week. I I'm hoping to do it maybe around. Let's just, let's just focus before Thanksgiving. How about that? Well, the seller claims that possibly Friday or Saturday I may get it. Which, that could be interesting. So is there a chance I might be getting it the same day as my recon? Hmm. So I really want to focus on the recon review. But, here in Andy's randomness, we're always good at planning our content very well. <laughs> okay, yeah. So the seller right here, I can give him a shout out. A bunch of these guys who are in Georgia. And... They knew I had them on my watch list probably for a, almost a week now. They literally dropped the price today from $49 to $44. And I'm sorry that I had to use the other eBay code, but got to understand. I mean, you don't see a value like this. And supposedly there's a rumor this device will get updates until 2029. So, yeah. Pretty good lifespan. So basically, I'll try to see if I can use the developer options. I think I can use developer options to maybe fake my location on the Chrome browser to Ocean City, Maryland. See if I can get WBOC, because this does have an HDMI port, so maybe I can plug it into my television. 
That might be an idea. At least like to have this iPad to maybe use, check the sports scores or something. Let me transition this to the kitchen because in the living room, it's just, it just looks so bad. Look at my kitchen setup, excuse the mess. I'm just having these random lunchtime thoughts on a Monday, Columbus Day today, so yeah. I didn't think I was gonna upload a video today, guys, but I'm so excited. You know, I'm snagging these deals and I, I just can't wait to now do two reviews, all right? So I won't rush everything. I won't really, really everything. And no, I'm not gonna attempt to put windows on here because that's not the point. So I think I can get a couple of Android apps that could be useful. Who knows, maybe the DirecTV app works. Maybe I can get Location Faker, like some Android phones have. And you know what, that doesn't work then, yeah. I have ways of getting the Ravens. Believe me, I do, guys. Believe me. And besides, look at my iPad. You know, I have a location faker tweak. Jailbroken from Pale Rain. It's still called Pale Rain, right? Hope I'm saying the jailbreak tool correct. There's my location faker, guys. Yeah, I don't want to necessarily say goodbye to my iPad. I still like the screen, but again, in my living room, I, I just like to have a laptop. It, it's just, you know, and who knows? Maybe I can get Radar Scope too. That was another reason why I looked really hard. I'm like, hmm, Google Play Store is on here. And I just literally bought another Google Play code. So is there a chance that Maybe radar scope will work too. I'd like to see how I can multitask and get IEM bot radar scope. Because with 8 gigs of RAM, it should be possible, right? <sighs> Boy, guys, I'm keeping optimism, you know? You know, only the post office wasn't closed today. That would be a different story. All right, everyone, so that's pretty much going to wrap it up here, all right? So I want to finish lunch and also edit this video, so yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, I can't wait, guys. Another new tech to review, and again, if only somebody can help me out finding a 12991 Radio Shack. I'm still, still looking for it, all right? Well, if somebody can help me out, that would really be great. Somebody on eBay can come through. That would really help. Because then after that, no more radios. Done collecting. All right? So that's it, guys. Thank you for watching.